inside J. Lo and Benefolk's tumultuous marriage amid allegations that her diva demands could end their romance and a hidden new movie. And as the newlyweds begin collaborating on a new film project, those tensions are only expected to worsen. They have reportedly been seen squabbling at red carpet events as he objects to her revealing shirts, according to sources who claim Ben, 50, is becoming weary of J. Lo's 53-year-old diva demands for everything to be perfect in the search for their ideal home. Jennifer has already discussed how challenging it has been to move their blended families in together. The couple, known as Benefer, who had broken off their initial engagement 20 years previously, appeared to have achieved a storybook Hollywood ending when they wed in Las Vegas last July. In contrast to the business-like vocalist, Ben, a recovered alcoholic, is rumored to favor a more laid-back way of living. When their film Unstoppable approaches production, an insider in the business worries that the explosive combination could send the young couple over the edge. Ben wants to slow down a little, the source told The Sun. Although that is what he needs, Jennifer doesn't really operate that way. She's more spirited than Ben and an all-or-nothing kind of person. There is no way to turn it off, and this is not a person who enjoys watching Netflix while chilling out. Unstoppable, which is being produced and funded by Ben's new company Artists' Equity, will certainly be tense as Jen gets ready to film it as a result. Anthony Robles, a one-legged wrestler who rose to fame in the movie, is the subject of the documentary. In a statement confirming his wife's participation, Ben said, What fun, what a joy to do something with her, see her be great, go to work with your wife, go to work with your best friend. The insider is concerned that Ben, who started Artists' Equity with actor friend Matt Damon in November and has three children from his first marriage to actress Jennifer Garner to consider, may feel too much pressure as a result. Ben has a lot on his plate merely managing the choices he must make both his employment and his new business venture, they claimed. He wants to relax or talk to his kids on the phone when he gets home at night. Ben has experienced hell and back more than once, and he has never had more obligations. It's a challenging time. He has also received criticism on social media for appearing disinterested during award shows. The Oscar-winning screenwriter, actor, and director of the recent successful sports biopic Air, however, were supported by The Insider. The guy doesn't deserve to be ordered around, dragged to questionable social gatherings, and criticized on every minute detail of his day, they continued. But when he wed Jennifer, he knew this was what he was getting into. She doesn't stop for anyone, like a Duracell bunny. He gives off the impression of a man who has just returned from a protracted tour of service in a combat zone and is now dealing with a tornado striking his home. Last weekend, J. Lo and Ben were seen arguing in their car while stopped at a red light. Later, in a viral video, he led his wife to the passenger side before slamming the door shut. Days later, at the opening of Jen's most recent Netflix movie, The Mother, the couple appeared to be fighting in front of the public. The Let's Get Loud singer was seen making gestures toward her hubby, who appeared irritated. The incident followed another heated argument at the premiere of her romantic comedy Shotgun Wedding in January, as well as their infamous exchange at the Grammys a month later, when Jen chastised Ben for not acting friendly or motivated throughout the ceremony. After their wedding in July of last year, however, it was all smiles and loving demonstrations of affection, and sources claimed that a breakup would be embarrassing. Regarding their rekindled romance, J. Lo expressed her gratitude and pride in her relationship with the man that we were given a second chance is a beautiful love story. She did, however, acknowledge that combining their two families, which included four teenagers, had been an emotional process. The teenage years are difficult, she remarked. They begin testing you in every way. You have this baby for a while, and then all of a sudden, it's like your greatest little friend, who loves to be with you always, is like, get out of my room. The pair is reportedly searching for their family's new ideal home in Los Angeles, but Ben is reportedly getting tired of Jen's demands after she abruptly canceled at least two purchases. He'll joke with me sometimes. He'll say things like, where's the rest of that shirt? She admitted. Or similar items. Oh, this one doesn't have anything else, I think. During tense media attention 20 years ago, Benifer ended their relationship. Jen later wed three times, while Ben got hitched to actress Jennifer Garner.